So on demo day, when we're talking to our neighbors, the one question that's often asked is why tear down the whole house versus doing a hand demo and maybe a value out build. When it comes down to it, a full demo is more cost effective. It takes about 24 to 48 hours to complete and allows us to be able to start with a clean slate that allows us to be able to build a beautiful and quality product that's gonna stand here for the test of time. So the second reason why we do a complete demolition usually has to do with the underground plumbing. Now, when you're working with a 70 year old home that resides on a lot, like the one that sits behind us, you're gonna have cast iron, plumbing, and sewer lines underneath the foundation. The time required to saw cut all of our concrete, remove all of our old plumbing, and replace it with new plumbing, not only creates inherent structural issues that could arise, but typically is not a cost-effective way of being able to provide the best product on the market and that's another reason why we take care of complete demo. Number three, and I've talked about it before, is the concept of functional obsolescence. In the real estate industry, what this means is that uh, the floor plan that currently resides and anything that we could be able to put in its place would essentially not meet the demands of the current buyer of the way that they wanna live in today's modern day living situation. It's for this reason that when we start with a clean slate, we're able to move forward with a better floor plan that provides a better return on investment for the way that that person lives every day, day in and day out. Number four is when we complete a full demo, we typically are able to find the leach field and the septic that resided on this house almost 70 years ago when it was built. By removing this piece, it allows us to be able to add any additional functionality with pool or landscaping in the rear by reducing a hazardous environment that existed years ago when this house was originally built. So number five, and I know this is gonna be probably the most controversial one, is it actually provides less impact for the neighborhood. And let me tell you why. Ultimately, if we were to remodel this house, I almost guarantee you over the next 70 years, it's gonna be remodeled again and again and again. The reality is, is that with design patterns changing more frequently and fast than ever before, mostly due to HGTV and other things, we're seeing remodels happen every decade. So at the end of the day, by building a new development home that's gonna stand here for the next 70 years, ultimately it's probably only gonna go through two or three remodels versus another seven remodels as it trades hands of ownership again and again and again. These are the main reasons why we're demoing, building new here in some of the best communities here in the Phoenix market continue to follow along our journey as we continue to redevelop many of these amazing homes. And as always, have a great day.